everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. I never welcome my new subscribers and I get them every week and I'm so grateful for that. So welcome to Life and Style by Liz, where we have a lot of fun. I don't do a lot of editing, so if I fall or misspeak, it's all gonna be in this video. That's kind of the fun part of it, I guess. Anyway, you guys, Thanksgiving is coming up. We do not have much time. We need things to wear. Typically, we are either hosting or going somewhere for dinner. And these outfits actually can work for any of the holidays that are coming up when you're going to someone's home. Because when you're in the home, that's a little more difficult to like pick out an outfit. You want to be comfortable, but you want to be dressed up because it, there is an occasion involved with this, etc., etc. So let's go over what I'm wearing for the first outfit. All right, you guys have seen this a million times, but worth showing again. And what I love about this, this is my large gold medallion necklace. That's how it will be linked below. You guys, I'm seriously gonna try <laughs> and make a conscious effort not to touch my hair. No promises. It's annoying to viewers. It's annoying to me. It's a lifelong habit. So you know how habits are. And then what happens is I see myself and I'm like, oh, I got to move my hair. I got to do this. It's, it's, fly, it's There's a flyaway. There's this. So I'm going to try. I really am. All right. So large gold medallion necklace. The reason why I like it is because you can take a simple shirt or simple dress or simple outfit, throw this on and it really does dress up the outfit. A lot of people are new to wearing necklaces. I myself just started wearing them maybe about a year and a half to two years ago. I was always someone who felt like between my makeup and my hair, I had way too much going on, but I started wearing them and I realized that they add so much to an outfit. So if you have not, try um, one of these necklaces. You know, I always choose necklaces from Walmart or Amazon or somewhere affordable that is great about returns if you absolutely don't like it. All right, and then these earrings are by Time and True. I cannot link them, they are in-store only, but when you're in Walmart, walk by that time and true they have like an earring wall typically fantastic earrings at low low prices i want to say these were probably under five dollars if i wear them constantly because i do wear necklaces i like simple earrings and i am wearing my small gold medallion bracelet you guys want to hear a funny story i got a comment from one of my videos last week from a viewer that told me my bracelets were making clinking noises and her dog kept looking and barking because to him, it sounded like another dog's collar. I thought that was the cutest little thing. She probably didn't think it was funny, all the barking, but anyway, thought I'd share that. All right, so what else am I wearing? Well, one of the things we like to do on Thanksgiving is wear fall colors. I figured this gorgeous, I wanna say like butterscotch color. Well, let me go over it layer by layer first. Okay, so the cardigan is first. You guys have seen this before. It's um, kind of like a long, sweater the sweater coat almost it's thicker than i would say your average cardigan it's cable knit it has these adorable tortoise shell buttons all the way down in the pockets that i love here's the length of it i've been loving cardigans this season and they are on trend like you would not believe i think they add so much to an outfit so depending on the weather you could wear this over to whomever's house you're going to or in your own house if you get chilly and then just take it off or leave it on depending on the situation. So right now, I'm gonna take it off. You know I like to take off anything hot. I get all the sun in this bedroom. I'm not complaining, but it does warm up. Next, which is what I should have waited to show you, I am wearing a Sofia Vergara gorgeous stretch top. This one is not a bodysuit. So for those of you who do not like bodysuits, I know Sofia has a lot of bodysuits and I wear a lot of them and show a lot of them. But this one almost has the look and feel of a bodysuit. Tons and tons of stretch. You know I'm wearing it in a size small, my usual. It's got these lacy arms, and let's see, lace to here, but yet it's not lace that is see-through. So you're good there. Family appropriate, right, for the Thanksgiving table. And then it tucks right in. The best part about this outfit are the pants. This is a complete Sofia Vergara outfit, by the way, except for the shoes, which I'll show you in a sec. Um, these are considered like, I think they listed them as pull on jeans. These are not jeans. These are black pants and they're like a hidden gem on the Walmart website. Of course, everything will be linked below if I fail to mention that so far. But you guys, oh my goodness, these pants 
I, these have been online, I think, since last year, and I always passed over them because I'm like, pull on jeans? Like, that sounds like a no-go for me. Well, they're not, I took a chance, I ordered them. They're not jeans, they feel like pants. Also, good for Thanksgiving, we have elastic, an elastic waist here, you guys. Look at it, I almost revealed my leopard underwear on accident there, maybe I did. Um, great for Thanksgiving. I'm gonna size down, I got them in, I have the tag tucked in here, a size four in their big. So, you know, maybe size down, depending. I feel like they're kind of a mid-rise. I'm pulling them up a bit, but I would say, well, my belly button's right here and they kind of meet. I am short-waisted, so it could be different on everyone. I'm going to return them and get the size two. In fact, what I usually do is I order the size I want immediately, <laughs> probably after filming, and then I'll take them back to the store when I go into Walmart. So these are so, so comfortable, you guys. Here's the back. It's elastic, but it's not that unflattering like diaper butt elastic pants. Two cute little pockets and plenty of stretch. So look, I'm gonna sit down on Thanksgiving and I am not gonna feel stuffed. I still have lots of room. Let's face it, it's a big meal that we all wanna enjoy and not have anything pulling or, or too tight or whatever. And then I'm wearing, from Target, you guys, remember I showed you these last week? I've been wearing them all week. I swear, I'm like a little kid. I get something new and I wear it constantly. These are just those mules. They almost look like a booty, but instead they're a mule. So, so comfortable, cushioned flatbed. Why do I always say that? Cushioned footbed, not a flatbed. We're not towing anything with these, although size 10, you probably could fit a car on top of here. Um, I like the rubber bottom. They're like no skid and they don't make noise when you clink down the hall at work, which is one of my things I don't like. And I was able to get a nine and a half, as I mentioned last week, and I feel like my feet are just so tiny because I'm a 10 and I'm truly a 10. This is like one of the first times I've ever been able to take a smaller size. So those will be linked below. I was so excited I was able to link them. Go on my link and you can get these shoes. They really, really complete the outfit. You guys know I like neutrals. I could absolutely have put on black shoes, but I thought these were cute, especially if you go to someone's house and you are going to slip your shoes off and you know you might want to have them easy on easy off so it's not a big deal as you come and go in someone's house all right you guys i'm back and i may surprise you with this one because you guys have gone on shop with me as if you've been with me for a while and different um hauls that i've shown i'm not a huge fan of the like i don't know what do we say little house on the prairie kind of look so this one might shock you. You may already be shocked just from the chest up here. But okay, let me tell you quickly, I did switch out some jewelry. These are my earrings from Target. I call them my Geo Circle earrings. I don't know why, but well, kind of, you can kind of tell why. And then these are my bracelets from Target that I've been wearing constantly as well. All right, guys. Yes, I am wearing a prairie looking dress. However, it's above the knee. It's really fitted at the waist in comparison to some of them. It's in a neutral pattern, which I'm good with, and I could wear my tall boots with it. These are the real original Walmart Time and True scrunch boots. I finally bought them. I kept on showing you guys the pair from last year, and I finally broke down and got these, and I love them so much. I like them way better than the ones I have from last year. So if you haven't already noticed, I have plenty of room for all of the Thanksgiving Day dinner right here. Oh, well, looking cute. So this dress is by Time and True. I'm wearing it in an extra small. I purposely got it in an extra small so that it would be a little more fitted on top. Uh, the sleeves are actually long sleeve. They go all the way to the bottom there. And I just think it's so cute. Okay, so it has this little tie here. You girl would never, but I'm gonna show it to you. Oh, well, now that I'm looking at it, it's not so bad. Oh, I have an itch. Oh, I don't know what, there's a hair or something on my face. Okay, look at that. Ah, is that cuter? Maybe that's cuter. No, I can't do it. I get weird with things around my neck, but it is cute. So check that out. So this, it does come in other colors. Um, if I can, I will put a picture of the different colors up on the screen here. But you guys, this is so nice. You wanna talk about being able to sit and eat. Look at that, and it doesn't ride up. It covers your legs. You can probably wear tights if you wanted to. I'm sure it would look cute with leggings and flats. 
course your girl had to put the high boots on and I love it you guys I really really do love it I kind of surprised myself and I will be wearing this dress to work as well because I'm always looking for easy dress dresses are so easy throw it on get out the door and if I put on my Sofia Vergara I'll insert a picture I don't want to say that word because that's not the name of them uh what is it called shapewear they're kind of like a little longer than a boy short almost a biker short shapewear under these I'll be warm from here to here will be the only exposure this little bit so that's a hint for wearing dresses in the colder weather all right I think I talked about this one enough I really 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 surprised myself that I even remotely ordered it put it on and I actually like it and am gonna keep it you guys I am back and I have to talk about this I have had it on all day if you don't know I am an ambassador for dossier fragrances they create designer inspired fragrances what does that mean well let's go over this one this one is called floral peony there is a classic scent it has been around forever called chloe by chloe and it has a sophisticated classy classic smell i have always loved it my mom used to wear it and when i say my mom is a lady that is putting it mildly so I can tell you that this has the classy and sophisticated scent you are looking for when you choose Chloe, but this is called Floral Peony. And some of the notes, to give you an idea, by the way, peonies are my favorite flower. I had them in all my, my bridal bouquet, my girls' bouquets, and my centerpieces when I got married. I, so it's so fitting to be in a classic scent. Anyway, it says lychee, peony, lily, freesia, magnolia, rose. What I like are the base notes. It's a musk and a honey. And you really, really get that. It's not super florally. I'm not a super florally person. It's just enough. It just gives me like a city vibe. You're dressed up, you're going to an expensive dinner. Fantastic. Dossier brings it. Look at this bottle. 1.7 ounces. This top is magnetic, which I love. I've shown you this before. Love that. And everything is at an affordable price. I will also give you my discount code. So the link to Dossier to this specific fragrance along with my discount code will be below the video in the description box. And the nice thing about Dossier, you can get this home. This giant bottle will be shipped to you try it out if you don't like it even though you've opened it trying it worn it for two weeks for all they care you can return it and get your money back so dossier is bringing it as usual i'm going to be showing you so many scents this holiday season it is a great gift to give you can give it with confidence knowing that these scents are unbelievable so i thought it would be a good idea to spritz on a little chloe when you're going to Thanksgiving dinner, because I really, really think it's a classic scent. It's not offensive. It's definitely something you can wear during the day and to a really nice sit down dinner. All right, what am I wearing? Outfit number three, I came back to my classic, my all black. Why? Because if I get stuffed, I have a lot of camouflage going on right here. Plus you guys, I don't know about you, but sometimes you can spill or splash or whatever, and you don't want to worry about that. Wearing all black kind of definitely does help. Look at this. Okay, like maybe it's not this outfit in particular isn't 100% appropriate for like Thanksgiving day with grandma or something like that. I don't know. I don't think it's too sexy, but it's just enough. What if you're dating someone and you're going to maybe just have dessert at their parents' house or something and you want to look cute? Or I don't know, I just, you know me. You guys, I like to look cute all the time, even on Thanksgiving, I don't care who's there. Which is probably why I like Sofia Vergara. This is a bodysuit by her. She loves bodysuits and so do I. The nice thing about this one is it's ribbed and there's tons and tons of stretch. There's a little ruching right here in the middle. I'm wearing it in a size small, it's super comfy. I don't feel like I'm being tugged at or pulled at or anything like that. But you guys, all right, you saw the boots already. You know, these are by Time and True. They'll be linked below. Love, love, love. You can wear, I've already shown you them twice. Just imagine, you can wear them over jeans, you name it. This skirt is ribbed as well. It's a sweater material and it's by Time and True. You guys won't believe me when I tell you. $10.97. Have you ever? I don't think you have. 
can you believe it? 11, just under $11 for this gorgeous skirt. Here's the back. Now, what I want you to take note of is how smooth I am under this stretchy knit skirt, which is unheard of. You know why? You know it, ladies. You know it. I am wearing Sofia Vergara shapewear, and they're not riding. This is the length, in case you were wondering. So not quite a super boy short down to the knee, but I'm sorry, not quite a biker short down to the knee, but like a boy short with about three inches. And it does the trick. I'm wearing them in the black. It, these came in a two pack. I got them in a size small. The skirt and this uh, bodysuit, by the way, is also in a size small. And they come in the two pack, you get a pair. Apparently we have a horn going on. You get a pair of nude colored ones and these black ones like I'm wearing. So you guys, I know I labeled this video Thanksgiving Day. If you think this is too much for Thanksgiving Day, you could swap it out for date night. I mean, what the heck, we're easy here. Whatever you wanna do. I'm still here to save you money, find you affordable, glorious outfits. And you know, what can I say? And make sure you smell good too, right? All right, all right, I heard you guys, Liz. We don't get dressed up. We wear jeans on Thanksgiving. Why can't you style Thanksgiving Day jean outfits? Here I am. All right, so, and by the way, if you're gonna wear jeans, then you absolutely better spritz yourself with a dressier scent that necklaces and perfume can change everything. I'm telling you, take my word for it. All right, so, all right, you wanna wear your jeans. Well, you better put a dressy shirt on at least, come on. So what I have here is this gorgeous white blouse. I've shown you this once, I think, a long time ago, maybe the beginning of fall. You guys, it's, um, remember in the 90s, look, the 90s are coming back. Let's, we have to, you know, wrap our heads around that, I have. And do you guys remember the poet shirts? They were so popular back then, I wanna even say in the early to mid 90s, the poet shirts were everywhere. These new kind of boho shirts, it's the poet shirt reinvented. So we've already done this, ladies. If you're in your 40s or like me, let me see. I got to give you the countdown once again. Where are we at now? Like six and a half weeks away from 50? You definitely remember the poet shirts. But anyway, this is a shirt I got on Amazon. I will link it below for you. It's adorable. It goes with everything. It's nice and flowy. It's not skin tight. I have it tucked in to my Sofia Vergara jeans. These are the high rise flares with the button fly. Again, I put on my cute little uh, kind of mule boot. They're like fake almost <laughs> uh, booties, my little mules. I just did that for some interest. It, this kind of has like a Western vibe to me with the big buckle and the pointy shoes that have like sort of a Western shape to it. And then the white blouse. This looks dressy. It's appropriate for a casual Thanksgiving. I've got my bracelets moving around, you guys. Oh boy, I wonder if any dogs are thinking another dog's coming. Now I'm going to be thinking about that. But I love the way this looks, and I want to show you how I tucked it in. So it's a lot of shirt. For someone like me who has no torso, <laughs> it's down to my knees, okay? It's a lot of shirt, and I'm wearing it in a small. If you're someone who doesn't tuck in, this is actually adorable. It's wrinkled now from me tucking it in. Um, because it's like short in the front and longer in the back, so you absolutely can really be easy breezy. Maybe even just do like... I don't know, would a French tuck work on the French tuck? Well, maybe not, that might look goofy, so don't do the French tuck. You probably could tie it though, if you wanted to. Let's try that. There's so many things you can do with this shirt. You can tie it, leave it that way. That way it kind of, ra oh, that looks cute. Guys, you can absolutely tie it. And again, don't forget, I'm wearing this in a small. But the way I like to accentuate my waist, I literally, watch what I do. I just gathered it in the front and tucked it in adjusted it a bit and then I did the same thing in the back gathered it and tucked it in and then you know fix it here and there to make it how I had when I came walking out adjust it as you wish and that's it instead of doing the tuck and pull up you know what I mean it's a lot of shirt so I just wanted to give you that tip in case you do purchase it all right what was that number four so you got denim you got a dress you got a skirt you got pants what am I gonna come up with next? All right, guys, did anyone guess leggings? Probably not, because I'm not one to show a ton of leggings, but Thanksgiving, 
may just call for leggings because we are gonna stuff ourselves to the gills, as I like to say. But let me go over real quickly. I put on my tiny, I think they call it collarbone initial necklace. It's just a little tiny L. I love this thing. You don't even know you're wearing it. And yet it adds a little interest to whatever it is you're wearing. I'm wearing one of my camis by No Boundaries. And they come in a five pack uh, with all different colors. You could choose your five pack. So uh, I will link them below for you. I'm not going to carry on about them. I do yell at you guys every video to get this five pack of camis. You're going to wear them under everything. So do it. And they'll be linked below. Um, the rest of the jewelry you saw, this cardigan is from Forever 21, which is why I put this necklace on because then you can throw, I think this necklace, honestly, look how cute it is, was $4. So get the cardigan, throw in the necklace and yeah, just do what I say. Okay. All right, these are high-waisted leggings by Time and True. They come in a two-pack, and I will link them below. And I threw on my little cut-out ankle booties. You guys, when I bought these, they were $25 or $25.99, something like that. They're down to $20, so get them before they're gone. I have worn them so, so many times, I can't even tell you. But, you guys, how dressy and appropriate, Thanksgiving appropriate, is this outfit? You look like you're dressed up. I'm loving, this cardigan I've worn a million times. I've been wearing cardigan, I showed you one in the beginning of the show, and I just love them because they add drama to whatever it is you're wearing. And I used to think, oh, well, then I'm not covered up and you know, I'll look too bulky or whatever, but you guys, look at this. You can see a shape under there, okay? There's no reason for you to feel like you're all covered up. It's just enough. And with all black underneath, oh yeah, you guys are gonna sit at that table. And by the way, comment below, what is your favorite dish on Thanksgiving? I know you guys are gonna say green bean casserole. Guess what, we never had that in my house. But stuffing with cranberries, my absolute favorite. Don't make me the homemade cranberry sauce. I don't want anything to do with that real fresh stuff. If it's not shaped like the can, I don't want it. Just saying. So every fork full of stuffing has to have some cranberries on it. All right, so comment below. I really, really wanna know what your favorite Thanksgiving side dish is. And I don't eat turkey. I actually don't eat meat. I only eat um, fish and seafood. But even when I did eat meat, it's been about four years that I haven't, I never liked turkey. It was like gaming to me. But you know, I'll eat all the sides. And because it's Thanksgiving, my gravy definitely has the drippings in it. Just saying. All right, I'm getting hungry. So this outfit is absolutely perfect. A great way to end your five awesome Thanksgiving outfits. And you guys, I just wanna let you know, starting this Wednesday, we are focusing on Walmart, gift giving, Christmas, holidays, you name it. Everything that December brings and end of November will be the focus of the channel from that point forward at least until the holidays are over. I may or may not be able to slip in the celebrity lookalikes for you guys. So, you know, sorry about that, but it's temporary, we'll be back. I just have so much I have to show you, you guys. So, so much. I am going to help you get through the holidays very, very easily. And by the way, to see more of these outfits or content that you don't always see here, follow me over on Instagram. It's just at Life and Style by Liz. I hope this video helped you today. I hope you found something that you can wear comfortably on Thanksgiving. That was always a day I struggled with. And hopefully it's, you just pick something. Are you gonna wear a dress? Are you gonna wear jeans? Are you gonna wear leggings? Are you gonna wear pants? And then watch my video and you can pick out some accessories and cute shirts and stuff to wear with it. All right, you guys, if you did like today's video, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps out my channel and helps other people to find me. And if you've not already, what are you waiting for? Please subscribe to my channel and hit that bell for notifications. That way you'll be notified each and every time I upload a video. I hope you're all having a great start to your week and I'll see you guys on Wednesday. Bye everyone.